Hey, Warren. So, this week you got a song by the Stampeders. I did. I got uh, Sweet City Woman. Sweet City Woman. How was it getting that song? It was actually amazing. I really, I really loved the original. It was challenging, though, because the genres are so different. But yeah. after reading an interview uh, that Rich Dodson did with CBC, uh, I started to realize that there were a lot of parallel similarities. I mean, when they were coming from Calgary to Toronto, they called it the land of R&D. Wow. And so it was, it was kind of cool to just read the history of it. Um, I just actually met Rich in hair and makeup. And oh, nice. He's a really nice guy and super cool. Uh, the pressure is definitely on for me today, uh, just to make sure that I do it justice. And um, all I am confident with is that I'm going to put my heart and soul into it and uh, do the best that I can. So was it tough tackling something so different? I mean, that, that's got a big banjo part, which isn't something it you does. might know. It actually not, has, uh, a banjo in the, uh, has banjo in the lyrics. Too. Yeah. yeah. Um, it was. I mean, needless to say, we don't have a banjo uh, <laughs> with us this evening. But um, that song was so much more like the melody, the hook, the, everything about it was it's so, you know, legendary and iconic that I think that will transcend any genre and tonight it just so happens to be R&B soul. So you're breaking out the falsetto? Oh gosh, I'd say it's 90% falsetto tonight. Maybe oh, 95. <laughs> <laughs> That's tough, yeah. but fun. It is. I mean, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see how the judges and the audience love it. Great. I'm sure they will. Yeah. Thanks, man. Thank you.